Due to numerous advancements in science and technology, our lives have become more comfortable and convenient with each passing day. Instead of riding horses and using wagons, we now drive cars and use buses, trains, airplanes, and ships, which leads to more use of fossil fuels. Similarly, instead of cooking food over a fire, we use gas and electricity. For these reasons, greenhouse gases, such as water vapor and carbon dioxide, are emitted into the atmosphere to an excessive extent, and this contributes to global warming when they absorb sunlight. These gases are mostly produced through the combustion of fossil fuels. When we wake up in the morning, take a shower, cook food, and then drive to work by car or bus, all of these actions result in the production of carbon dioxide. The temperature rise causes the melting of natural polar ice caps, and with their melting, the water level in the oceans rises, leading to the flooding of coastal regions and the reduction of land area. Other consequences include large-scale storms, floods, and heavy snowfall which create droughts that directly affect the health of people in urban areas. In 2015, the world took a bold step by signing a historic agreement on global warming in Paris. More than 190 countries signed this agreement, and according to it, they should change their energy policies and incur significant costs. The goal of this agreement is to keep the Earth's temperature from rising more than 1.5 degrees Celsius. China has the highest use of fossil fuels compared to other countries. In the years since the Paris Agreement was signed in 2015, we have seen both progress and setbacks in the fight against climate change. As we enter 2023, it is clear that the need for action is more urgent than ever. One significant update in 2023 is the increasing global focus on renewable energy. Solar and wind energy are becoming increasingly cost-effective and accessible, leading many countries to set ambitious goals for transitioning away from fossil fuels. In fact, renewable energy sources are projected to account for more than 80% of new power capacity added globally in 2023. However, despite this progress, there are still major challenges ahead. The world is still heavily reliant on fossil fuels, and emissions continue to rise. In addition, we are seeing the devastating impacts of climate change firsthand, from devastating wildfires to more frequent and severe natural disasters. As we look to the future, it is crucial that we continue to prioritize climate action and work together to reduce our reliance on fossil fuels. This means not only transitioning to renewable energy sources, but also improving energy efficiency, reducing waste, and advocating for policy changes at the local, national, and global levels.
By taking action today, we can help ensure a more sustainable and livable future for ourselves and generations to come. So let's continue to work towards our destination dreams of a healthier and more sustainable planet. Don't forget to subscribe and like to stay up to date on the latest developments in the fight against climate change. Can we really reduce the use of fossil fuels?